Hello, and welcome to On Luxury, a channel in which we provide you with the best in luxury from around the world and all carefully sourced from the 1% Club. In today's video, we will be going through some of the biggest and best names in the luxury watch market. As Ian Fleming, the writer of the James Bond films, once quoted, a gentleman's choice of timepiece says as much about him as does his Seville row suit. Now, before we kick off, make sure you subscribe to the channel and leave a comment below saying I subscribed, and we will try our best to personally reply to your comment. So let's go ahead and get straight into the video and starting from number 10 on our list. Tag Heuer. Tag Heuer was originally established in 1860, and it has made a real name for itself as a true innovator in sports timing. Today, the brand has a rich pedigree within the motor racing industry and has a long list of partnerships with racing organizations. Besides this, some of Tag Heuer's most well-known watch models are named after famous racing events, such as Formula One, Carrera, and Monaco collections. Legendary actor Steve McQueen famously sported a Tag Heuer Monaco in the 1971 film Le Mans, really cementing the timepiece's iconic status. These watches, although still not cheap by any stretch, are on the lower end on this list, starting from around $1,000 and then rising to over $50,000. Omega There are many reasons why this world-renowned luxury watch brand rose to fame. The Omega brand is steeped in history. Since 1932, Omega has maintained its role as the official timekeeper of the Olympic Games for 26 out of 28 games, and this is both summer and winter to be precise. Secondly, the Omega Speedmaster Professional, also known as the Moon Watch, was the first watch worn by an astronaut walking on the moon. It holds the prestigious title of being flight qualified by NASA for all manned space missions. I'm sure I don't need to mention that it is also the current choice of watch worn by James Bond himself. Pierce Brosnan kicked things off in 1995, and Daniel Craig has carried on the tradition of being the latest Bond to rock the Omega. As with all of these luxury watch brands, they attract the attention of the rich and famous. Fans of the Omega include John F. Kennedy, Elvis Presley, and George Clooney. Omega have a diverse range and wide variety of timepieces, making this brand somewhat different. Compared with other top-notch watchmakers who prefer a smaller range offering more exclusivity, the price range of Omega watches runs anywhere between $1,000 and $700,000. Breitling. As planes reached greater heights, Breitling flew alongside them. Breitling is known for its precision-made chronometers designed for aviators and was founded in 1884. Due to the dependability through changing environmental conditions, the brand is popular with not only aviators, but also with firefighters and astronauts. There is a special adaptation of a distress beacon in the Breitling Emergency 2 model. This can be particularly useful as two British pilots who crashed their helicopter in Antarctica back in 2003 found out when they were rescued after setting off their transmitters. The brand is forging a new path for itself in the world of luxury watches by taking on fresh challenges and carving out more refined, smaller timepieces, which still channel the essence of the brand. Back in April 2017, the luxury Swiss watch brand Breitling was sold for a staggering $870 million. It certainly looks like clear skies ahead for the brand. David Beckham is said to be a lover of the brand, and the price of the watches can range between $3,000 and $280,000. IWC The international watch company was founded by an American watchmaker, Florentine Jones, back in 1868. IWC is best known for their pilot and diving watches, which have been precision engineered in line with the highest industry standards. As the field of aviation really started to expand back in 1936, IWC released their first pilot's watch, which was an early mock-up of the famed Big Pilot's Watch. As a result of this, the brand was even commissioned by the British Royal Air Force to develop a service watch for its pilots. Famous wearers of this iconic watch brand include Jason Bateman, Sasha Baron Cohen, as well as Bradley Cooper. Given the history of IWC, the price tag that comes with the company are to match, with timepieces starting from around $4,500 and going up over $100,000. However, owners are in good hands as IWC keep a meticulous catalog of every single watch they've ever manufactured. 
It is also said that they have a stock of spare parts that allows them to repair any watch they've ever made, dating back to conception in 1868. Impressive. Rolex. Rolex is one of the most recognizable watch brands in the market. It has accomplished something truly special as Rolex is a universe of its own. Respected, admired, and known across the world, it is truly a brand that everyone has heard of and that is rare within the luxury market. Contrary to what most people believe, it all started in London for Rolex, not Geneva. Unlike so many other watches in the market, Rolex watches not only hold their value, but have tremendous aftermarket value, making them a real asset and a watch to invest in. Some of the most popular timepieces include the Submariner, the Yachtmaster, and the Daytona. In my eyes, every avid watch collector should have the Daytona in their collection. Each timepiece is still made by hand and crafted from the finest raw materials. Rolex makes over $5 billion in sales, which is a key reason that they ranked 64th on the Forbes list of the most powerful global brands. To keep up with the huge demand, they must produce around 2,000 timepieces a day, which I'm sure you will agree is a lot of volume for such a luxury product. Some of the most famous fans of Rolex include Justin Timberlake, David Beckham, and Kanye West. The price range of this incredible brand ranges between $5,000 and $650,000. The most expensive Rolex ever sold is Paul Newman's Rolex Daytona, which went for $17.8 million in 2017. Cartier As we all know, Cartier is a well-known jeweler producing some stunning pieces. However, Louis Cartier created his first wristwatch in 1904, and it was inspired by his Brazilian pilot friend, Alberto Santos Dumont. Cartier designed what would later come to be recognized as the first pilot's watch. This technology really did move the dial. Please excuse the pun. Pilots were relying on pocket watches, which, as you can imagine, were fiddly and dangerous to fondle with whilst trying to fly a plane. Other extraordinary achievements include the Cartier tank and the Ballon Bleu de Cartier, which were best sellers for the famous watchmaker. While some of the other watches featured on the list may stand out on the wrist, a Cartier watch is a little more refined. Just by taking a quick look at a Cartier watch, it's easy to see why the brand has such celebrity appeal with the likes of Kim Kardashian, allegedly paying $380,000 on a Jackie Kennedy Cartier watch at a Christie's auction back in 2017. Also a wearer of the Cartier watches is Tom Cruise, Michelle Obama, and Angelina Jolie. Outside of auction houses, the price of these exquisite watches run from about $4,000 to $250,000 plus dollars, and you can see why. Jaeger La Coulter, or JLC as it is known, is one of the most prestigious and well-known Swiss watchmakers, and they design most of the components for their timepieces in-house. One of the finest watches produced by JLC is the Reverso, which is a reversible watch. But this is just one of the impressive timepieces from their range. They are known as one of the most creative and inventive watchmakers in the industry due to the level of complication watches and innovative designs. That being said, JLC produces around 60,000 watches annually, which is a considerable amount for such a prestigious brand. Now, looking at the wearers of these magnificent watches, it appears we are in good company with the likes of Pierce Brosnan, Jamie Foxx, and Christian Bale. Like all the brands in this video, they are not cheap, with the starting price around $4,500, going all the way to over $600,000 plus. Audemar Piguet Founded in 1875 by Jules-Louis Audemars and Edward Auguste Piguet, AP, as known by their fans, really hit it off and was credited for producing the first steel luxury sports watch in the Oaks series. AP has simply been ahead of the game for hundreds of years. They are known for exquisite designs throughout their collection. Today, AP strictly limits their production numbers to around 40,000 timepieces per year, and the brand continues to value its identity as an independent, family-run business, being still owned today by its original founding families. All watches are produced in-house, using traditional old-fashioned handmade techniques, meaning every piece is meticulously created in a non-automated process. This is seen clearly in the classy design on the faces of every watch. This is a truly classy watch, and don't just take my word for it as it appears. I'm in good company seeing as Tom Cruise, LeBron James, and Usher also love to sport the brand as well. 
the price of these beautiful watches run about $7,000 to $850,000 plus dollars. Patek Philippe Patek Philippe only produce 50,000 watches a year. Compared to other brands that produce around 1 million per year, this is a very limited amount. The detailed production process behind the watches is the reason for this low number. Even some of the Patek's most basic watches take up to nine months to produce. They take pride in design and have made top-of-the-line watches since its founding in 1851. Some of the most iconic timepieces of Patek Philippe watches include Moonface, Star Charts, and Perpetual Calendars. Only selected individuals can purchase the Patek Philippe Grandmaster Chime Ref 6300G. The reason for this is that Patek wants to ensure that the watches only go to collectors who, quote, genuinely appreciate and value them. And this application process can take up to two years. Patek Philippe supplied watches to Queen Victoria. Patek received the honorable task of delivering watches to Queen Victoria and Prince Albert in 1851. This also include her consort. These legendary figures really optimized Patek Philippe as a brand of royalty. As you can imagine from such a prestigious brand, they carry a hefty price tag. The price range of Patek Philippe ranges between $15,000 and $1 million plus dollars, and the most expensive Patek Philippe ever sold was Henry Grave Jr.'s super complication watch that went for $24 million back in 2014. Patek Philippe resembles true watchmaking perfection, and as such, you can expect the brand to have some of the most exclusive clientele among all the watch brands. Other notable celebrities that love the brand include Ellen DeGeneres, Nicholas Sarkozy, and the avid watch collector Robert Downey Jr. Richard Mille In my eyes, probably the most well-known for high-end, luxury-exclusive watches, Richard Mille, at the age of 50, created his own brand of watches, which matched the traditional style of watchmaking with the contemporary designs and materials he is well-known for. Having been in the industry his entire life, you could say he was well-placed to find his particular niche of the luxury watch market. Richard Mille watches are renowned for their transparent backs, skeleton-looking dials, and flaunt a very futuristic feel. The watches are said to be a symbol of the love of aircraft, cars, and anything mechanical. You can see this from one of the company's most popular watches, the RM011, being customized for F1 driver Philippe Massa. As you can imagine being number 10 on the list, Richard Mille timepieces are pricey, and staying with the racer car theme, they are like the Formula One of watches, where they are far more than the sum of all of their parts, pushing timekeeping to the highest form of technical art. With pieces of around $2 million, these watches really are in another league. It is no surprise, then, that they are popular with stars like Rafael Nadal, Floyd Mayweather, and Kanye West loving the brand. Well, as they say, time is money. I hope you found this video helpful and inspiring. Maybe you think I have missed out on a brand which deserves to be in the top 10. Let us know in the comments below. As always, remember to stay on luxury. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.